Maya said people may forget what you said, but they will never forget how you made them feel. We have a number of ministers or cabinet secretaries who impacted the lives of Kenyans and they will remain in the hearts of Kenyans forever, whether they are alive or dead. The following are the seven cabinet secretaries or the ministers who impacted the lives of Kenyans. Number one, may God rest his soul in eternal peace, John Michuki. He came up with the popularly known rules as Michuki laws, and this transformed the transport sector. The laws are still in place up to now. The only thing is that they are not being implemented. And he also went to the Ministry of Environment. He brought sanity in the forest, and that's the time even forest guards were given uh, guns. Number two, may God rest his soul in eternal peace. Professor George Saitoti. Professor Joyce, I taught as a minister for higher education during the time of President Mwai Kibaki. He brought so many reforms in the education sector, and that's the time even you were able to get free uh, books, exercise books, textbooks, and uh, free primary education. When he took over the mantle of Ministry of Interior and Coordination, Professor Joyce, I taught he was able to stop and silence the support land defense forces. Number three, is none other than the former vice president and the minister for home affairs honorable moody award moody award as a minister of foreign affairs he brought reforms and sanity in the prisons the inmates for the first time were able to watch television the inmates were able to sleep on a mattress they were able to have uh, a blanket they were able to be visited by their wives those are the admirable reforms that Modi Awori uh, brought. Number four, Raila Amolo Dinga. As the Minister for Public Works, Roads and Public Works, he demolished most houses that were along the road and uh, major cities, especially in Nairobi, Mombasa, and Kisumu. And he brought a good shape in those cities. Number five, His Excellency Musalia Mudavadi. Musalia Mudavadi was a minister for finance at a time when the economy of Kenya was down. There was a great depression, there was multipartism agitation, the, the golden back scandal had just taken place, but he brought the economy of this country back to its feet. When he went to the Ministry of Local Government, uh, the government of, uh, uh, coalition government of Kibaki and Raila Odinga, as a deputy prime minister, he's the one who murdered who laid the infancy of, uh, of devolution. And finally, is none other than uh, the current president, William Samoy Ruto. As a minister for higher education, he reduced the number of uh, years the students after Form 4 level were staying at home in order to join universities from around two years, one year, to just a few months after finishing Form 4. And in the, when he went to the Ministry of Agriculture, he was able to reduce the cost of fertilizers to around 2,000 per sack, and the cost of hunger was just 8 bob per kg. That one has never happened up to date. What's your take? Any other ministers that made Kenyan happy? Add. Thank you.